video is a little bit long time coming. I did include this in my year of haul, but I was being very cheeky and sneaky and I didn't open it up. I don't know why people like watching unboxings, but I do as well. I think it's something to do with that you're there while they're opening it, so it feels like it's yours and you're opening the thing as well. I think that's what it is. But Today I'm going to unbox my first Chanel. This is something that I've always wanted to purchase. When I was 21, I had a really silly life goal of owning a Chanel classic flat bag at 21, but I had the option to buy it and go financially completely broke or not buy it and be able to pay rent, etc, etc. So this one I went to Europe, I was like, I definitely have to get something from Chanel. I was like, maybe I'll just buy a pair of earrings or something because it's small and affordable. And then I was like, I'm never really gonna wear them, so I thought I might as well buy something that I would actually use. When I first saw the wallet on chain, I thought it was very stupid. I was like, what kind of wallet would be this small? Like, what's the point of you? can't put anything on it. But then I looked at reviews and I watched people's um, like blog posts with it and slowly but surely fell in love with it. So the Chanel store that I went to was in Paris. It's on 31 Rue Cambon, which is also the first store that Chanel was established in. Pretty sure that's it. If I'm wrong, I'm very sorry. I think the first Chanel store in Paris was on Rue Cambon. This is the box. I carried it all the way from Europe back to my home in Shanghai, and then I didn't have a chance to film the opening, so I had to carry the box all the way back to Melbourne. Um, I'm sure you've noticed this box is a little bit different to all the other Chanel boxes. It is white with black on the bottom, and a lot of stores are just regular black with white writing. And I think this is the only one in France that does this. And I thought it was the only one in the world, but apparently, um, I think Ginza in Japan, in Tokyo, also does it as well. So, I was wrong about that. But anyway, let's get opening. So, let's us take off this silver bow first. Stick it on my head. We've got some, I don't even know how I'm supposed to do this unboxing. White Chanel ribbon with a uh, silver Chanel writing. <laughs> are you ready? So, this is the address of the Chanel store. Okay, so let us lift the lid up. I'm gonna try to do this. Then up with my fingers. Oh no, I just smudge foundation on the box. I don't know if you can see it. Gross. Okay, so we opened it. It's black on the inside and we can see this. I'm going to take that out. There's a little care, a care packety thing. Don't really need that. So, this is like the little flat bag. And then... <laughs> So yes, I got the Wallet on Chain in classic black with the gold. Um, when I went there, so the Chanel store that we went to, I should take this off, Chanel store that we went to, there was a really massive line, basically like a 30 minute wait time. And I was waiting there and I was going on Google and I was like, pretty sure I want to get this. I didn't want to spend that much money on a wallet. And then I thought it was 1300 USD. And then when I got up to the front, I was like, can I just get the classic black in the smooth leather with the gold detailing? And she was like, yeah, yeah, sure. And I was like, how much is it? She was like, I think she said, I think she said like 1600 euros and I was like, whoa, that's a lot more than I bargained for. But then I was like, I already waited 30 minutes in line and I already told her to bring it out. And under all that pressure, I was just like, okay, I'll just buy it. But if I knew it was going to cost that much before, I would have probably just bought a wallet or just not bought anything. But you know, you go through all of that, you can't just walk away because you got to stick things out to the end. So when you open it, there is a little um, piece of fabric protecting it. I'm going to just slide that out. And then you can see it on the inside. And then the chain is wrapped in lovely white paper. Definitely keeping this because it's got Chanel printed all over it. And it's got a Chanel sticker on it. <laughs> oh, oh. Wow, this chain is so long. Also, you can see um, with each card slot, they have filled it up with white paper. That is black on the other side. Magic, won't be needing these anymore. And... <laughs> oh, ooh. Oh, this is my authenticity card. Cut d'authenticité. What does it say? Renom de notre marque. Something about your marque. Chanel. Um, and yes, there's a little zip. Nothing in there. Nothing in the back pocket. Okay, let's show you the little wallet on chain then. So there you go. That's what it looks like. Um, let me know if you guys want a little bag review or a little what's in my bag, but that's what it looks like. And now, after two months of holding it in the box because I wanted to do the unboxing, now I can finally use it. What a joke, guys, because I actually opened this like two weeks before because I got a bit impatient and I wanted to look at it. My mum wanted to see, so I opened it and then I carefully wrapped it back up. So this whole video was just basically fake because I already opened the box and I already saw the bag, so. Yeah, sorry. 